And he's like, you know diabetes is hereditary. So I just stared at my parents. Not because I thought they passed it to me, but they made me eat a lot of cereal sandwiches growing up, so I know that had something to do with it, right? Uh, I love my parents. I love my parents. My parents did such a good job of hiding how poor we were growing up. Like, we weren't dirt poor, but we were dusty. Uh, yeah. Like, my mom. My mom would take me and my sister to the store and, and convince us that the generic foods were the better foods, right? Yeah. So when I went to my friends, I was like, what's this Dr. Pepper and Sprite y'all drink? Because we had Dr. Thunder at my house. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I was 15. I was 15 before I knew cereal came in a box. Uh? <laughs> Double tied your cereal up, baby. Uh. I was in class every morning crying, kept my stomach full of fruit rings. Uh. Teacher didn't know what to do with me. Uh. Y'all drunk Kool-Aid? Had flavor aid in my house. Uh. Yeah, took a lot of sugar to put flavor in flavor aid. That's that's so why I got diabetes now. Uh. Now, but because of the diabetes, right, I had to lose weight. I've lost weight, now I hate compliments. Because the first thing people say when they see me now is like, man, Richie, you lost a lot of weight. Like, hold oh, on now. I lost that lot. Like, I wasn't that big before. Like, no matter how long it's been, it's like, man, Richie, you lost a lot of weight. Like, first of all, good morning. <laughs> Second of all, you saw me yesterday. Uh, and I get it. I do. I get it. It's but it was what two years. You know what? Y'all came out to the late show on a Saturday. I feel close to you already. I'll tell you the truth tonight. I went back into the office after two years, and my white friends, my white friends, was like, "Oh my God, Reggie, you look amazing. How much weight have you lost, man? Hey, keep up the good work." My black friends, though, my black friends was like, "Hey, Reggie, you sick?" <laughs> Like, you trying to lose weight? Like, oh, I hate y'all. Oh, I hate y'all. Because it's crazy, right? It's crazy how we see the same situation and describe them totally different. Like, white friend came through recently. He's like, hey, Richie, man, you heard about Bill? Bill died last night in his sleep. Oh, man. I hate to hear that, man. I'll, I'll be praying for his family. Black friend heard the same story. Came right up to me. He's like, hey, Richie, man, you heard about Bill? Man, Bill woke up dead. He said, what? <laughs> You lying. Bill woke up dead. Man, that's crazy. Oh. 